All right. So now the operator goes to the machine, puts in the two pounds, pulls it up. It's still not quite there. So this time the operator decides uh, he's going to uh, bring a bucket of ink back. Okay. But this time he's not going to bring back the 32 pounds. He's going to lose three pounds in the process. Okay. So now he's going to return 29, all right? So what happens when he returns 29 pounds, okay? We're going to add to this. We've decided we're going to add, that I, I don't know what I said if I said it, one pound of reflex blue. We're going to add one pound reflex blue, okay? Plus one pound reflex. We're thinking that's going to get us there, okay? So, but the operator is bringing back an amount of 29 pounds. So what we need to do is, of that 29 pounds coming back, we need to calculate, all right, how much warm red is in there right now, because it's less amount, how much rubine red is in there, and how much reflex blue of that, the, that two pounds that we added the first time is in there. And see, now that's the beauty of having this, this formula. Because we have the ratios to that point, we can calculate how much of each part has returned to us by doing this. We're going to take that 29 pounds, we're going to multiply it by 0 0.703 to, to calculate how much warm red is in there, by 0.234 to calculate how much rubine red is in there, and by 0.63 to calculate how much reflex is in there. Once we've calculated that, we'll add that one pound reflex to it and recalculate our formula. Okay, so here we go. Uh, 29 times 0 0.703 equals 20.387. 20, 29 times 0 0.234 equals 6.8. 786 and 29 times 0 0.063 equals 1.827 and now just to check let's make sure that this amount adds up to 29 okay so let's see what we've got 20.387 plus 6.786 plus 1.8 Eight two seven equals beautiful. All right, that adds up to twenty nine pounds. Okay, that's the amount that we have there. So in that twenty nine pounds that came back, what we have is twenty point three eight seven pounds warm red, six point seven eight six pounds rubine red, and one point eight two seven pounds uh, reflex blue for the total of that twenty nine pounds. Okay. Now to that we've decided that we're going to add one pound of reflex blue. So now what we we can do is we can say okay. Uh, let's take, let's add that one pound reflex blue. So we're adding zero to this. We have, still have 20.387. We still have 6.786 here. And, we, and now we have, instead of 1.827, we're going to have 2.827 as the new amount in this ink that we've just mixed and we're getting ready to send to the press, okay? So now let's see. That should be that one pound plus 29 pounds, that's 30 pounds, right? All right. So we have a th total of 30 pounds now, and uh, we're gonna uh, um, uh, we're gonna calculate the ratios for this where we are at this point. Okay, so these are the latest ratios. What we need to do is multiply, uh, multiply, or actually divide each one of these numbers by the total of 30 to calculate the ratios for each one of these parts. So here we go. 20.387 divided by 30 equals 0 0.680 and then 6.786 divided by 30 equals 0 0.226 and 2.827 divided by 30 equals 0 
nine four and that should add up to one so let's give that a quick check I've got a nine four I've got a zero point zero nine four in there plus point two two six plus point six eight equals one great beautiful so that adds up to one point zero 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 so now we're going to leave it at that you can just continue this forever now every time you do an add and do a mix you get a little more complicated and you may have to back this up and say okay now we think we have our color uh we think we have our formula the next time we do this ink we're going to pay attention if we have to modify it we'll go through this process again but we'll start off with the with this formula here and then we'll do it again and we'll tweak and it's always a process of of adjusting and monitoring and feedback all right so pretty soon we're gonna we're gonna talk about some other things including working this ink off into other inks that come up so we can reduce our inventories and uh, and doing some other things that I'm going to show you alright so let's see so right now if the operator goes out there and this is and everything works that's our formula okay okay great I think that covers it. 